The Galactic Free Press Update: The Great Gift of the October Surprise. Greetings, love beings. Wow, it has been intense and wild energy for the past week, just like we shared would occur in our last update. Today, at least the energy is calmed down enough for us to be able to share and express what has now occurred and is occurring. In the past two days, we have gone through two more portals. These days, these portals are coming one after the other. These high energy portals are bringing us closer to all of you, and all of you are coming closer to us. Also, as these open, more energy of reality or pure consciousness energy pours in. These particular portals are preparing everyone energetically for the powerful. Manifestation energies of the portal opening of 11:11. This one is going to be lighting up your lives in a grand way. The time to be clear of all old energies is now. We are birthing a new paradigm, and each of you are being reconnected to the unified field on the planet, and this is unstoppable. Quoted from Sonic Alchemist. We are returning to the great galactic mother father god goddess in total oneness. End of quote. Quoted from Marine Moss. The energies are intensifying and will become more so in the closing days of this cycle ahead. As the next 2 months progress, there will be even more profound breakthroughs and breakdowns. The divine descent is upon us as heaven is brought to earth through us. We are being made impeccably authentic and honest with ourselves and each other as the energies continue their relentless pursuit to break us off all of the mental and egoic strongholds that have held us hostage on all levels of our creation. Our personalities are being strongly guided in these final hours to let our souls lead us to peace. If you will allow yourself to be guided, void of resistance, You will know alchemy, spiritual magic, vertical magic, and meet your true state of being. Now, before the cycle closes, all of creation stands at your ready to assist you in doing so. We are almost out of the cosmic birth canal, and what was for foremost a very challenged labor, the Great Mother Earth and all of cosmic consciousness await our delivery. With great love. and deep respect for us all. During this time of intense labor, many have learned their own limitlessness and watched their endurance prevail. <clears throat> many have accept- accepted their eternal limitlessness, though many still struggle with the belief they are not. It is now that each of you are asked to recall the memory of your original condition, as it is the driving force of evolution itself. Our freedom is at stake, beloveds, and an arms reach for the first time in our collective human history. Freedom has had no history for the human race, and now it shall. We in this planet are being purged of everything that has made it impossible to be free. We are relentless, courageous, and collective race intent on making this shift in both consciousness and vibration. enabling us to shine forth as the brilliant beings of god light we are in this final stretch we are learning the vital importance of staying in the present moment of now and noticing there is nowhere to go end of quote the october surprise has come and now has left us a great gift a deep cleansing which we shared would be arriving to us this came in the form of hurricanes typhoons storms emotional upheavals and intense clearing energy these are a great gift because they clear old energies for the higher energies of love and truth to enter more of the old has now been washed away and this will assist us greatly in our final thrust towards the galactic alignment Through these events we were able to focus the intense energy coming in and redirect the consciousness on the planet to ensure a smoother transition into the new paradigm per Gaia's request. We accomplished this as the entire planet was focused on these events. 
many came together in compassion and care to assist each other. Quoted from Bella Kaposi, The trust and fortitude of humanity is being put to the test, challenged in its ability to place love first before all else. To believe that underneath whatever and however things appear on the surface, that there is an underlying divine plan at work. Gaia is shifting. She is twisting and churning and shaking off the darkness and debris of the Piscean Age, an age which is fading and dying and rapidly coming to a close. Like a set of clothes which are too tight, she rips free of her old bondage. Gaia is patient. Gaia is kind. Gaia is forever tolerant of her children's follies, even at the expense of her own health and comfort. But now, at last, today is Gaia's day. From high up in the heavens, rains down the crystalline rain to wash her clean and lift her higher up and closer to God and further distance from the destructive paradigm of the old. <clears throat> the earth is moving, she is transmuting. She is taking you with her on her holy journey, thus in turn rendering you her willing passengers transformed as well. Welcome to the shift in all its glory, and I say glory because it is glorious. Oh, of course, tragically, there has been destruction and confusion and massive upheaval. upheaval. Yet I ask of you, how can it be otherwise? How might a pristine new earth be built atop that which is toxic and needs cleansing? Trust that you are being monitored closely, and we are nearer by you than you are able to perceive in your current state. You are, each and every one of you, a precious human angel. As an indispensable member of the team of light, you must have trust that your safety and well-being are of paramount importance. End of quote. Gaia is now also requesting all fantasies about what is really occurring on this planet to be dissolved and cleared, and this includes all who consider themselves real light servers who are not really in the oneness energy and are serving as minions or the ego mind and pretending to be participating in the lightworker community. Through these portals, each of these beings has been given notice. In this energy, they are being requested to let go and transform or get swept aside through this cleansing energy. From this point on, this all has to be dissolved so humanity can actually see the path clearly without any more distractions. From the Gaia Portal Update, extremes of clearing are expected at this time. Ambiguous energies are present with Gaia and individual humans as transitions and upgrades are processed. 2012 fantasies <clears throat> are being dissolved, bringing angst to some. <clears throat> Release of outdated irrelevances is being encouraged. Moment-to-moment -moment living is the only path to inner peace. And truth is winning no matter the external events which are really shaking it all up. The whole truth will no longer be ignored, and this is the bottom line. End of quote. This month is going to be powerful energetically, and there are no seatbelts. We have many incoming events all month. Right now, the grid continues to light up, and our craft have moved very close to us, closer than you may think. This energetic movement for the planet and our craft will continue through the remaining portals till the end of the year. Get ready, everyone. Once this cleansing is complete, Liftoff will occur in a grand way. Decreed by heaven, all remaining density which needs to be removed or transformed is to occur immediately for the next facet of the divine plan to unfold. This is the divine plan manifesting now on planet Earth, Equal Heart. Thank you for spreading these messages to others and keeping your hearts open and staying tuned in. And transmission in all love is unconditionally, we are so in love with humanity. Love the Galactic Free Press staff, Humanity's Earth Allies, the Company of Heaven, and the First Contact Ground Crew Team. 